Well, hello and welcome to the House Valentina fashion channel. Today, we are going to be stocking you up with new H&M items. I have just placed a big order and I've got 14 items to share with you today. And I'm styling each of these pieces up and showing you how you can very easily style them with items you might already have in your wardrobe. And of course, I'll give you links for items from H&M that are alternates if you want to be able to style them up with something that you might not have. But either way, I'm gonna put all the items down below in the show notes so that you can shop them if you'd like to but I hope today you'll also get lots of outfit ideas that's something that I really love I love getting outfit ideas so I feel empowered to get dressed in the morning so I think you're gonna love these pieces I hope you'll hit subscribe give the video a big thumbs up if you are like me and you love some H&M finds I just love it and there's always so many pretty things and I cannot wait to share each of these with you so let's jump in Well, let's start with a piece that I'm already wearing. Today, I'm wearing this absolutely gorgeous cardigan. It's one of their premium pieces, and it is absolutely amazing. This one is made with cashmere, and you really just feel the warmth, and it's an incredible piece. I love something like this because it really transitions you through these last bit of winter months if you're watching this during winter. A piece like this is great because it works really well during the winter, but it also works great for spring and for fall. So a piece like this will be able, you'll be able to mix it up so many different ways. For today's video, I've mixed it with the black trousers. These are ones that I found at Zara, but H&M also has a similar pair. I just think it's really nice to have a, a, a slim, straight cut type of trouser. It just, they're so comfortable. This is something that I just wear even when I'm just hanging out at home. I love them paired up with these gorgeous, look at these shoes, you guys. Look at these shoes. So in the outfit, I've got it paired up with these great shoes, the gorgeous cardigan, the black trousers. And then of course, don't forget, a little trench can really just help you get through the seasons depending on where you are in the seasons. I absolutely love the little Demilie bags. I think they really elevate your H&M pieces. And I think it's really fun if you have a white piece for your top black trousers to maybe mix in a white shoe and a white bag. I also styled this up with one of the other pieces that is on the rack and that is this pair of trousers. I absolutely love buying trousers from H&M. You can use a pair of trousers like these in countless ways. You'll be able to use them probably most of the year unless you're somewhere that's just utterly frigid and even then just put a pair of uh, one of the cuddle duds <laughs> underneath them. They are absolutely gorgeous. I love the pleating on them. It's a light pleating and these are amazing because they look, here, I'm gonna set the hanger down here for a second. These look like they have a like a regular waistband, right? However, if you look on the inside, they are actually elasticated. So these are really comfortable if you're working from home or you're gonna be in an office and you're gonna be sitting down for a while. A trouser that has no give in the waist can be quite uncomfortable, especially if they're high-waisted without the elastic. And I think that you will absolutely love these. All of these items I've bought in my regular size and I'm gonna note down below what I bought. Maybe one of the jackets I bought in an extra small, but if I get there, I'll let you know for sure. But yeah, take it in your regular size. They're absolutely gorgeous. They've got pockets in them and they look gorgeous styled up with the cashmere cardigan, white trench coat. And I like to put a little black bag with that because I had the black shoe on. Now these are a little bit longer on me and so I was wearing a four inch heel. So if you're a little bit taller, you're gonna be fine. And then of course I can always decide to hem them if uh, I wanna have them with uh, the little pair of loafers that I'm also gonna be showing you today. But either way, you can wear these in the summer with a tank top. You'll be able to wear them with all different tops throughout the year and the options are limitless. And especially in this sort of light, creamy, it's not even a beige, it's almost like just a really pale cream color and they are stunning. The trench coat that I'm wearing in that outfit is also an H&M item. Now, mine is actually last year's model. However, I saw that they also came out with more of these. So I could not recommend this piece enough. It sold out as soon as it came out last year and I just truly adore this piece. It's just extra special. It's got lots of layers in it. It's a little bit different and it's just a little bit asymmetrical, if I can say that word. And I just kind of love it. I think it's absolutely stunning. And I think a white trench just is a little bit different. I love all the little details on the sleeves on this one. And I just thought that it was spectacular. This looks amazing 
with almost anything in your wardrobe. This is great when your temperatures are starting to warm up or they're starting to cool off at that transitional period. Uh, it's just a piece that you'll wear for so much of the year and it's just gonna go with everything because white, it just works. So I just really love it. I think it's really sophisticated and elegant and I thought it was really nice paired up with the cardigan and the trousers and yeah, I thought it made a really great outfit. Next up, I have another pair of trousers. You can see these are a little bit darker. You'll be able to see one is more cream and one is a little bit more beige. These are absolutely stunning. I have left the tags on because I want you guys to tell me if you love these outfits and if I should keep everything. I always like to watch the video back afterwards. It's a really good tip. If you aren't sure if you like something, take a video or a picture of yourself wearing it and then you'll be able to take it look then you can take a look at it and see if you really like the way that it looks. These are uh, amazing. They're made with recycled polyester. These do not have as much stretch in the waistband, but I did wear mine regular size in these and they were quite roomy. So I think you'll be okay. Even if you're gonna be sitting down in these, they've got a roomy waistband. They're, they're very forgiving. They've got a really nice pleat on them. I mean, how pretty is that? They've also got the pockets, which to me is mandatory for a pair of trousers. They do have the sealed back pockets as well on them. Now these were quite long on me, so I had to wear that four inch heel again with these, but I really do love the way that they look paired with the black tank top and with the little black coat. This is another item that I already owned, but they have them in stock again, so I wanted to share that with you as well. That is this beautiful boucle jacket. I think that this with the buttons is just spectacular. I, so every time I wear this, I feel like a Parisian girl. Like I feel like I must be watching, walking the streets of Paris and I just feel good in it. I don't know, it's just one of those things. I love the way that it has that gorgeous material. I love the way they've added the little buttons with the little medallions on them and it's a gorgeous piece. And these sell out so fast, I recommend just checking them out because if you can grab one, just grab it because they're really affordable. But again, this is a piece that you'll be able to mix with white, with black, beige. Uh, you can put some color underneath this if you're a color lover, I know, clearly. I like neutrals and that's where my comfort zone is. But you can very easily mix a piece like this in so many ways. I'll even throw it over my shoulders with a pair of shorts as the temperatures warm up. I also paired that one with the coach bag. I love that half moon style and I think it just adds a little bit of casualness to an outfit that otherwise looks barely dressed up. But you could also, if you're taller, you won't have to worry about having those hemmed. But if you're uh, petite like me, I'm five foot one, uh, then you might wanna have them hemmed and you could wear them with loafers as well. It's just a really nice cut and really, very just, even though they're voluminous and very comfy, then I just think they look really chic too. Next, I took that same jacket and I mixed it up with this absolutely gorgeous dress. Couldn't you just die? Oh my gosh, how is this from H&M? <laughs> I know, I'm like, how is this from H&M? I'm telling you, I found some amazing things. Look at the detail on this dress. It is absolutely gorgeous. At the moment, you can probably tell, I've got the fire going. We're getting to the end of winter at the moment, so I'm looking forward to having this piece for spring and summer, but I'm not gonna wait until then to wear this. I think it looks amazing with the little braided sandal that I have, a little high-heeled sandal. This would be amazing to go to a christening or to a dinner party. You could wear it to a wedding. There's so many different times that you could wear it, but I know I will be wearing it to go out to dinner with my husband, and in the transitional time of year, I think it is nice to throw that little jacket over it and I think it looks amazing. I also like to pair it up with a white bag just to give it a little bit of contrast and to bring in the color of the shoe. But either way, you could also you could also throw a sweater right over this and just wear it more like a skirt. So lots of options with a dress like this. And truly, I, I mean, most of the time, something like this would cost you a small fortune. I can't believe they had it at H&M. I know, it's so good, it's so good. Next up, I have this absolutely stunning pattern dress. I don't own a lot of patterns. There's, a little, there's literally only two things in here. I tend to do solids most of the time. I don't tend to find patterns that I particularly like to wear. 
This one looks amazing. I'm gonna show you different ways to style up a long dress. Even if you're petite like me, you can 100% wear these dresses and not look short in them. I think, well, you guys can tell me if you think I look short in it or not, but I don't think I look that short in them and I do like that longer length. It's just a really nice length to have. This one I styled up for you with the same white braided sandal. I also left the the tie that comes with this. This is the belt that comes with it and I left it for you so that you could, you'll could you get to see a few options for these longer dresses. I do think it's nice, you could button it right up to the top for a more formal look, but you could also unbutton and just have it a little bit more open. I styled it up with a trench coat. You could do a black one, you could do a white one. You could put a cardigan over this. You could put a, a crew neck sweater over and just have the top coming out. There's a lot of different ways that you can style up a dress like this. I have it styled up with the sandals, but you can also style it up with a pair of boots and also it'd be amazing with a pair of loafers. If you're just gonna be running around town, running errands, a dress like this, you just throw on, it's a no-brainer. And I think that we need pieces like that in our wardrobe. And that's why for me, I realized I didn't have a lot of dresses. I don't have a lot of dresses, period. But I really didn't have anything like this. And so that's why I was excited to try some of these on. It's got a nice big sleeve too, so you can um, double it over and give it a little cuffed look if you'd like. It's very pretty. The quality on it is absolutely gorgeous. And I think that you guys are going to love it. You could also leave it without the belt as well. There's lots of different ways to style up a dress like this. You can wear it for most of the year, honestly. I think even in the winter, you could just take a little like fur vest and put that right over it and really just warm it up. So great piece. So next up we have these loafers. And unfortunately for me, I ordered them in a 38 instead of a 37 and they're a little bit too roomy for me. So I'm gonna exchange these. In fact, I already ordered the pair of 37s. I've got them on the way. But yeah, uh, sizing for these. So a 37 for me is equal to a size seven in US sizes. Uh, but yeah, check the sizing on there, but they're amazing. And the only thing that's wrong is that I ordered the wrong size. I think that the faux croc on them is really pretty. I love the little brass details. They really have that sort of feeling, a little bit like those Gucci loafers. They're not super chunky, which I personally prefer. I, I haven't gone for the chunky loafer thing. Maybe I'll do it when it's just about to go out of style. I don't know, maybe I have to warm up to some things. I think these look really delicate on the foot and they really look amazing styled up with our next piece. Next up, I styled up this absolutely, I'm speechless. I can't believe that this piece is from an H&M. No joke, I cannot believe it. This is part of their, you can see they've got different tags on these. So when they have these little tags like this, those are usually their higher quality ones. They have a premium, so H&M has premium collections and this I think is one of those. This is a wool blend. It is heavy and like all the right ways. It feels like it must cost a million dollars. It is. It is incredible. It really is incredible. It's got a gorgeous little uh, sleeve where you can cuff it if you'd like. It's got those beautiful pockets on the front. Beautiful, uh, this, I love the collar on it. You can button it up all the way. You could unbutton a couple. You could wear it without the belt. You could also cinch in the waist on this one. I sell this up with the loafers and a little black bag because I wanted to kind of dress it down and make it really easy. So yeah, if you have a little black belt, if you wanna, over the summer, you could also add a little Breton one. There's a lot of different ways you could mix this. And just like the other dresses, you could add a cardigan over it and wear it almost like a shirt and a skirt. You can add a coat over it. There's a lot of different ways that you can style up a piece like this, but I thought that it was just maybe the find of 2023. It, it's that incredible. If you can get your hands on it, grab it. A, a dress like this tends to sell out almost immediately, so it's actually quite heavy. I'm getting my workout. <laughs> I'm trying to hold it. Next up, I bought the same dress in two different colors, and I thought it'd be really fun to show you how you could style each of these up. I have belted it. I've put a beautiful, uh, kind of creamy color coat over it. I've got the boots. I love those faux croc boots. I'm gonna leave all the links for the items even if they aren't h and I'm gonna leave everything for you. A dress like this is so easy to style up. You can add the sunglasses if you'd like onto this little outfit. These are super cute. I added a chunky gold necklace on this one as well to just show you different ways that you could style this dress up. 
I think that they look amazing. You could you could very easily style it up with the belt that it comes with, but I think switching it out just gave it a little bit more detail on the front. And then of course, you can put it with the boots like I did, put it with a sandal, a loafer, and even a sneaker would look really cute. You could even just throw a jean jacket over this. Then we also have the white one. And again, you can see you can see a little bit more of the detail on it. That pleating on it is absolutely gorgeous. This time I wanted to show it to you without a belt at all to show you how beautiful these dresses look. You can wear them a little bit more, I don't know, a little bit more captain style. The way when we lived in Morocco, that's the way that the ladies would wear their dresses. And I thought that that was just gorgeous. It is quite long, so for someone like me, wearing a boot definitely makes that height look right on me. Uh, even if you're taller, I think you're still gonna be fine. But I do like the longer length, and I thought it looked amazing with a nice four inch heel. And it's really fun to wear it with the boots. But I'm also looking forward to wearing this in the summer, because you could just as easily have a little bikini on underneath this, or a little black one piece would be really cute. And you could totally wear this with a little pair of flat sandals, and it's gonna be amazing. So yeah, lots, lots of options for this one. I also got this little cheetah print dress and I said in a recent video that I wasn't buying cheetah print anymore. And then I saw this dress and I was like, just have to have it. So it's not that I'm against cheetah print, but a lot of times it doesn't look very sophisticated. And I think this one is done really well. It looks very, high end to me. You guys can let me know what you think. Is this one a keeper? I love the ruffle bottom on it. It's just a little bit different. So you can leave this without a belt and just wear it nice and long. I threw on the black loafers with this, which I thought looks really cute and a little black bag. Of course, you could also belt it in, wear a trench over it, throw a wool coat over it, just like we talked about before, throw a little cardigan over it if you want. But either way, a dress like this is just a little bit of fun, a little bit of pattern, and it can just really help your wardrobe to just feel a little bit exciting. And it just adds a little bit of contrast from all the solids. So you guys can let me know what you think about this one. I thought that it was a really beautiful uh, dress and I was re I'm really excited about keeping this one. This is another one that I think is gonna be great in transitional weather, but also it's gonna be great when it gets really warm to wear to the beach, wear just in the beach towns when you're just kind of walking around. I would also wear this to a business meeting. If I was gonna do that, I would definitely belt it and even think about putting on the little coat with it, with it. See how we can make yet another outfit. There's so many outfits. That's what I love about these great kind of pieces you can find at H&M because they are really affordable. They can make your wardrobe absolutely incredible. And there's so many different outfits that you can make with them. You'll be able to keep something like this in your wardrobe for many, many years to come. So I think they're really classic. I think that they're really fun. And I really found that these pieces really, they really do have a nice quality to them as well. One last thing I got were these sunglasses. They're just kind of fun, aren't they? Just kind of fun. Camera goes crazy. <laughs> it's trying to find my eye and it's like, no, I can't find you. I think a little pair of sunglasses like this is really just fun. It adds a little chic moment and you can wear that with every single one of these outfits and it's a really great finishing touch. You guys have seen throughout all the different bags that we're able to style the wardrobe up with. I think having a beautiful bag just really helps your outfits just feel really elevated and sophisticated and I think that's what sunglasses do as well. I'm so excited about each and every one of these. I hope that you love them too. Check out the links down below. I'll have them for you if you wanna be able to shop or just get Get more outfit ideas, check out my LTK app because that is where I'm gonna be posting all of the links for these items as well and the outfits if you wanna be able to see the outfits together. I use it for myself. I put the outfits up there so that I will remember the combinations. That way when I'm like, I got nothing to wear. <laughs> nope, can't figure out what to do with this. I'll look on my LTK app and I'll be able to pull up my own mood boards and I just share those with you. So they are shoppable but I think the inspo there is hugely valuable, at least it is to me, and you guys can let me know if you enjoy that. Uh, but yeah, otherwise I hope you'll hit subscribe, come back, hang out with us. We've got some more exciting videos coming your way very soon, and I cannot wait to uh, see you then. Oh, I just realized I don't have my coffee. I have to say cheers, that's my, my habit. If you're new to the channel, you're gonna be like, why does she need her coffee? Because <laughs> I usually have my cup of coffee. So I'm gonna go make myself a cup of coffee and go clean up the mess that I left in my bedroom. I'll see you guys in the next one, <laughs> bye.